to beat the emergency crews. Third fire this week. Someone's been a busy little Decepticon. Personally, I hope it's a big Decepticon. More than punch! Okay, let's spread out and... Whoa, 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 whoa! You're under arrest for arson and whatever else we can think of before we put you back in stasis. One bot's arson is another con's virtuous demolition of the impediments to forward progress at maximum velocity. Huh? Yeah, you said it, Crazy Boat. He's a genius, a visionary. Illumination through acceleration. Okay. Grim and I will handle the blaze. Strong arm, try to catch those two before they set anything else aflame or spout more gibberish. Way ahead of you, sir. Literally. <clears throat> you know, I am the one that Decepticon barreled into. Fine. If you can catch up to Strong Arm, you can help her. But don't let anyone see you. You won't believe how fast I've gotten. Just watch. Crazy Bolt, genius! You defend those who would imprison us, officer. I'm not following. Those machines we torched were building speed bumps. We'll slash and burn anything that tries to take away our room to zoom. He burns! And I slash! arrest to your rap sheets. You'll excuse us if we instead opt to point our hood ornaments at the unreachable horizon and renew our vows of go, go, go! <laughs> I wish these cons had come with a translator. Are you hurt, sweetie? All Autobots, immediate assistance requested. 
See a police vehicle with a towing hitch like that? Sweetie? Sweetie? You're awfully quiet, Cadet. I caused that accident, sir. I should have found a way to avoid that on-ramp. I should have used a different maneuver to dodge that flame burst. It all worked out just fine, Strong Arm. You'll be more careful next time. Let's get back and see if Fixit can triangulate Crazy Bolt's signal. So thanks to my lightning fast sidewalk surfing through the woods, I made it there just as the van started to go over. I reached out, closer, closer. Be listening to the emergency frequencies as you look for Crazy Bolt's signal fix it, in case he starts another blaze before we can locate him. Aye aye, and ear ear, sir. What can I do for you, strong arm? You can take this, sir. Regulation 924, Section 35. An officer who fails to put the safety of the public first shall be placed on administrative leave. I'm not accepting this. I have made an inexcusable mistake, and I can't be sure I won't make another one. <laughs> Stay with me, little fella. Stay with me. I am a loose cannon, sir. You can't let me out there! <sighs> Could have gotten off there. Could have swerved there. Playback stop. Rewind. Allowed. Don't these squishies know they're blocking the path of the genius of Go? Illumination through acceleration. Yeah, let's chop and fry. Yeah. Sorry, Lieutenant. Now that Strong Arm won't be going into the field, the hitch for Grimlock's trailer has to be clamped tightly to your chassis. Beat, you need to get Strong Arm off her chassis quickly. Take it from a parent. Strong Arm wants to be a part of the team, but the mistake she made on the freeway is all she can think about. She needs a win, a safe win, where there's no chance anyone can get hurt. Something not in the field. I am troubled by the way you were looking at me, Denny Clay. Fix it. Could Strongarm be your assistant for a while? I mean, is there anything simple you could ever do? Well, I don't see what. 
Strong arm size prohibits her from being in the command center with me. The team needs you, fix it. I need you. Well, I guess I could rig an exterior control panel. So long as Denny Clay never does that again. This is a bad idea, Lieutenant. Well, if you're going to be on administrative leave, you need to perform administrative duties. Fix it, can you bring up the location of Crazy Bolt's fires? Maybe we can find a pattern. Denny Clay and I are currently running a diagnostic on my system. Perhaps Cadet Strongarm could assist you instead? Okay, fine. What do I push? The blue button. Easy peasy. Take cover. That won't be necessary, Lieutenant. Defense system override. Authorization, spark breaker one. Secondary authorization. Coolest dad ever. Ah! <sighs> My bad. I built the keyboard for undersized digits. Yeah, but I'm the one who pushed the buttons. I can't even type without endangering others. I'm just gonna go sit over here and rust. Can't hurt anyone that way. Now she's gonna need a really big win. A major conflagration in the Crown City State Park. Fire crews are on the scene, but if Crazy Bolt is there... Fix it. Pull up the file. Let's get the whole story on him and his minicon. And type carefully. Crazy Bolt, a drag racer on Cybertron, has a fanatical devotion to a philosophy of speed, and his Minicon Slice Dice has a fanatical devotion to Crazy Bolt. They were imprisoned after destroying most of Steel City, whose buildings they said impeded Cybertronian's natural velocity. To them, the forests are one giant obstacle to be erased. There are living creatures in those woods and human homes nearby. So how about less talk and more punching? I, I can cover for you with the fire department. I'll get my hat, a bottle of liquid smoke, and a size double 16 extra hairy mustache. Actually, Crazy Bolt's flames are so intense, emergency crews seem to be holding to a wide perimeter. If I can guide you around it, you shouldn't encounter any humans inside the fire zone itself. Although I could use some help monitoring emergency frequencies. I don't like being at less than full strength. If only we had another Autobot to lend us a hand. <laughs> Made it. Barely. Big is beautiful. Ha! Path widens, the spirit lightens. Lights out, Khan. You don't touch Crazy Bolt. No one touches Crazy Bolt. You are one goofy little butt. when the wind wants us to glide. Good call, Chief! The flames will keep them busy! Illumination through acceleration! Let's move, Grim. We can still... Strike that. This fire's getting too intense. We have to help the emergency crews. Huh? And the ducks, too? Uh, uh. Help! Uh, uh. Help! 
Fix it. We've located six human bird watchers trapped by the blaze. Who's there? Scrud. Uh, halt! This is Fire Marshal, um, Den Russ. For your safety, stay in your shelter and cover your eyes and mouth because of the smoke. And stop. Ugh. Fix it. I need rescue crews here ASAP. You're at the furthest point from any emergency personnel. We can send tanker planes to drop water. But that will take time. Time's exactly what we don't have. We could carry the humans down the mountain. I know we're robots in disguise, but they might be able to keep a secret. Humans aren't nearly as insulated as we are, Grimlock. With heat this intense, they'd never make it. But, but there's gotta be something we can do, right? I don't like fire! I can't punch my way through it! Maybe you can. Denny, fix it. Get those tanker planes here as soon as possible. We'll buy you the time. We're gonna make a fire break, Grim. We need to clear the area around the humans of grass, sticks, or brush, so there's nothing left to burn. We don't mean to rush you, Fire Marshal Denrus, but it's getting a teensy bit warm in here. About half an hour out. Our fire break won't last that long. Put strong arm on the line. Strong arm here, Lieutenant. But wouldn't you rather talk to someone I'm who... trusting you with this message for Optimus Prime, Cadet. Sir, soon the fire will be hot enough to melt our armor. So since this may be the last time we speak, I needed to apologize. What? Why are you apologizing, sir? Strong arm, I pursued the Decepticons through this blaze without searching for civilians first. That's a huge oversight an inexcusable lapse in leadership. That is not true, sir. Everyone makes mistakes. What's important is how you respond to them. Thank you, Strongarm. But if it's so easy for you to forgive me, why won't you forgive yourself? Cadet, these humans won't make it unless you grab as much water as you can and douse us a trail we can lead them down. Denny, fix it. I need all the water you have, some way to get it up that mountain, and a little customization. Ho ho! Come on. Just a little further. Lieutenant Bumblebee, send your revised coordinates. I'm almost there. Impressive work, Strongarm. The humans are in a small shelter up ahead. You take them to safety, we'll keep out of sight. Once you get off this mountain, climb aboard.
Officer! Officer! What's the matter? Did I do something wrong? Thank you. Oh. Uh, you're welcome. Just... just doing my job. And though crews have no idea what started the blaze, they assure us that the fire is now fully contained. Are you ready to return to active duty full-time, Cadet? After all, Crazy Bolt and Slice Dice are still at large. Ready, willing, and able, sir. It feels good to get back into action with all of you. Look, Look out for the, the gnomes! Please. I'm a professional. <laughs> <laughs>